Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be filming a little what I eat in a day. I am actually very, very surprised that I'm still pregnant and able to film this video. I'm 38 weeks now, and it's just crazy because if you've been keeping up with my channel at 33 weeks, we didn't think we were going to make it much farther past that point because I was in preterm labor. So the fact that it is already five weeks later from that and I am still pregnant is just... I don't know, it's crazy. And now we're getting to the point where we're really anxious and just like ready for him to be here. So we're getting a little frustrated, like we thought you were coming early and now you're just taking your time. So yeah, today I thought since I'm still pregnant and I have nothing to do, might as well just show you guys what I eat. I just made my breakfast. I made a smoothie bowl. Um, it's just super simple with banana, pineapple, almond milk, and some protein powder. And then I topped it with dried mulberries, which you guys know is my favorite. This is what I've been eating pretty much every morning. Fresh smoothie bowls always sound so good when I wake up, even though it's winter. It's honestly not that cold out, like global warming is real, but also I just run really, really hot now. Like being pregnant, I am just like warm all the time. So a nice cold smoothie bowl in the morning is always so good. So yeah, that's what today's video is going to be. I really don't have anything to do. I have to run and go get some groceries. I wish that I wasn't so productive all the time because now that I'm like reaching the point where I'm just sitting around waiting to go into labor, I have nothing to do. Like everything's clean, everything is organized, everything's done for the baby. So I keep like trying to make up things to do to keep myself busy and like feel like I'm preparing, but really we've been prepared for so long that I'm just bored. So yeah, maybe you guys can expect a few more videos this week, but we're really, really hoping that he comes any day now. He's a super healthy size, super healthy. Everything is perfect. So yeah, we're really excited for him to get here and I'm so excited to start filming videos with him. But anyway, I'm going off on a tangent. This is my breakfast. So I'm going to go eat this and run to the grocery store and then catch up with you guys for lunch. All right guys, so it is a few hours later or maybe just like an hour and a half or so and I just made myself some tea. This is the raspberry leaf tea from Earth Mama. It's supposed to be really great for, uh, it's like a labor tonic. It's supposed to help your uterus contr like make your contractions more, I don't know, efficient <laughs> or something. It's supposed to just like help support a healthy quick labor. So I've been trying to drink this every day since I turned 37 weeks because that's when you're considered full term and it's safe to drink it. So. Yeah, I just made a big mug of this and I'm gonna drink that slowly. As you can see, it's really freaking hot. <laughs> then I'm gonna run to the grocery store and then I'm gonna make some lunch. All right guys, so I just got back from the store and now I'm sitting down on the couch to relax and eat some lunch. I'm just having leftovers, so it's not really that exciting. I can't necessarily show you what I'm making, but Caleb made this really good fried rice yesterday for lunch. He got this huge, really awesome wok for Christmas, so he wanted to try that out. So it was super easy. It's basically just organic jasmine rice that he cooked the night before and then just let it sit. I guess that that makes it better for fried rice if your rice has been cooked and sitting for a little while. I've never really made fried rice, so I don't know, but that's the way he likes to do it. And then there's carrots, broccoli, peas, shallots, corn, chickpeas. Um, I think that's it. And then he cooked it in some sesame oil and then there's liquid aminos and salt and pepper and garlic and onion. It's really, really good. So I'm starving. I actually started to get a little nauseous on my way to the store. I think I just drank too much tea before eating. So I really need to eat this and I'm very excited. So like I said, just chilling on the couch, trying to coax this dang baby out of me. <laughs> but I'm really excited to eat this fried rice. So I'm gonna try to find something to watch on TV and just chill for a little bit. I have my diffuser going and my salt lamp on, trying to just attract all the good vibes. So that's what we're gonna do. And then I know I'll eat a snack after this. I'll probably have a protein bar or something. So we'll see you guys very soon. All right, like I said, I knew I was gonna have a snack in a little bit. So I'm going to have one of these Nugo dark chocolate protein bars. They're so good. They taste like candy. I have them like once a day. And yeah, that's what I'm gonna have for a snack.